Hello everybody, welcome back to XCOM 2. I'm Neg Primer, and uh, we're gonna head in to this mission in East Asia. Uh, we'll get Kayla Cromer as a reward, and we'll, we'll counter Viper rounds. Uh, the other option was this one, uh, which would get us supplies uh, and block adding one to the, the counter instantly, but uh, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm more nervous about those Viper rounds than anything else. So we're gonna start there. We've given ourselves a little wait, uh, a little bit of leeway when it comes to the uh, the Avatar project, and we also didn't look at our squad last time around. Why am I not automatically in this group? Game is racist. Uh, okay. Yeah, so let's go ahead and launch this group right here. Sorry, I'm just checking everybody's everything and making sure we're good. But yeah, I think we've got a good squad here. We did good last time. Ooh. Oh, uh, okay, so I did a little bit of recording today, but I spent most of the day cleaning, actually. Strong, strong start to my spring break is to clear off the pile of crap that's been just sitting in one of my corners for a while. We need to move in and eliminate any hostile forces threatening that device. Uh, what I need to ultimately do is clear off all the counters, sweep the kitchen, and then vacuum the floor, get rid of all this dog hair. It's been over a month since my dog died now, and uh, there's still dog hair everywhere. That's supposed to be one of the best parts. That's supposed to be the best, the only good thing, I guess about not having a dog anymore is that not everything is covered in hair. And guess what? In my life, everything's still covered in hair. So... Hostile mm. forces are already moving to destroy the data tap installed nearby. We need to lock down the area and secure the device at all costs. I'm still at a weird point when it comes to bringing up my dog. I feel like... I should be a lot sadder than I am, I guess. Hello. Design, but these monsters are no better than the ones my father dealt with. What is that? What is that? What is that? We are in concealment. We're not on a timer, either. Oh, but we are trying to defend something, so we do have to make sure it doesn't get destroyed. Well, officially took up the only cover that we can all reach that'll do us all good. A good burger? I haven't had a good burger. Heading Not out. like, welcome to good burger. And then now. You, where can you go? Already there. Scanning. Overwatch. Of course, there's a mech right there. Well, we know where a good portion of these guys are. Nope, oh, except they just disappeared and I didn't see where they went. 
They're posting pictures of Miyamoto here. What is this, E3? Much to be able to no see them. Twice. Running. Moving to position. Moving. Where? Okay. Roger. I've got my eyes on. I'm on it. I don't have enough of you don't have eyes on them. On the move. For me to Overwatch. take that chance. Oh yeah, I forgot that about Nasha's character. Notch does his cool Overwatch thing. Location confirmed. Eyes on a hostile patrol. Understood. Moving out. Oh shit, what's this over here? Okay, that's just from one of those towers. Ruskles, let's get you over Probably. here. You. Oh, damn, they're coming over this way. Entirely sure why the camera went like that. Okay, where? God damn, where did that fucking alien go? Affirmative, moving out. Moving to position. I don't know what that other alien is, but it fucking, like, is somehow managing to stay out of my line of sight. Yeah, I know. Heading to that location. I want to leave you. I think I want to leave Jade Raymond there. Damn, like I said, they're Headed there now. making this kind of complicated. Scanning. Overwatch. On Overwatch. I'm on it. Affirmative. Covering now. It's 
do as much damage as we can while we can. Head the armor. We're visible here. Watch. decent there as they come out okay I don't know about this guy and I great camera guys I'm so glad I got a decent look at it oh damn it Jade I was about to say, don't tell me they're gonna move after that. Fifty-five percent. Come on. Yeah. Kill confirmed. Sixty-two. Ah, damn, she hit him, but she didn't kill him. Armor still holding. And I don't know about this thing over here. I think my smartest course of action is going to be to run over here. I'm going. Okay, we don't see anything in there. Could actually slash him. So let's make that, I guess, our last course of action. Let's I guess that'll there. be okay. I don't know what this thing is. It's like the upper body of a human floating around. Battle frenzy. I was worried it might, like, blow up or something. On the move! I didn't trigger another group, did I? Item in tow. Damn it! Oh man, another one of those! Well, I guess we'll see what this guy's all about. Uh, well, that staff apparently is just another plasma pistol. What's he doing? Oh, he's Psy zombieing. Shit, but he's in a position that he's actually going to be hard to get to. Oh, don't work. Okay. I thought he was trying to mind well, control just, us. Do that, Damn it, really? You don't have line of sight on anything from here? Sure thing.
Oh really? Can't make it very far with you. Shit. I seriously can't go more than like five spots? Whatever you say. I'm disoriented, that's why. Russell's. We're gonna get you all the way up there. So next round you'll be of some good use. Only a 54% chance on him. Well, that's all we can do with you this time. Sweet. Okay. What did you expect? I was nervous it wasn't going to actually kill it. That's what I kind of expected. Lady. And you. Okay, I'll go. Kill him. Oh man, he had one left. <sighs> so you'll be standing out in the open if I do that. I don't know what to do. You've got a better shot on either one of them. Okay. It's dead. It has to be dead. Run dry on ammo. Oh damn, didn't kill it. What's on fire? What's on fire? The thing that he's taking cover behind. You aliens today and your size zombies. Okay, let's go for it. That's how it's done. Can 
kinda wanna get the kill with my guy. What's over there? Where's Notch? Oh, haha. <laughs> Go ahead and hope this ends it. Ah. Because if not, Notch is probably gonna get caught on fire here. Status confirmed. Kay. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Cool. So only. Trader von Traderson uh, took the injury. That went well. We, uh. Yeah, he's the only one that took injury. He's over here. <laughs> And, uh, I don't know, we didn't really see too much about what all those floating guys were about. But, uh, it looked like their staff is just another plasma rifle. Hesitating when it comes to taking out the aliens. Oh, don't be such a drama queen. Scanning protocol. Wait. Increasing the specialist sight radius substantially for one turn and revealing any hidden or disguised enemies in view. Cool, that'll come in handy when uh, the faceless starts showing up. Kill zone. Take a reaction shot against any enemy that moves or attacks within a cone of fire. Okay. Not entirely sure about that, but sure. Uh, three kills, three, uh, ten kills over three missions. That's the best ratio of anyone. Of course I might be favoring myself. Archon corpses, huh? Half-hazard combination of flash and metal. Another impressive effort, Commander. My expectations were high, and we got yet Kayla. We exceeded them. Put her here, so we can clear this out all the faster. Um, Hello, Commander. That's a, uh... Tell me something, Doctor. Must have been pretty cushy working with Advent, living in the colonies. So why the sudden change of heart? Like most people, I wanted to believe that the aliens were legitimately interested in peace. Although they left me little choice when it came to working with them. I admit, I was drawn to the sense of normalcy they offered. It was a mistake. You should have known better. The aliens would never have come here if they wanted peace. As I said, it was a mistake. One I hope to atone for through my efforts with XCOM. Then I'd say you've got your work cut out for you. Okay, so... Uh, blue screen protocol... Munitions capable of disabling them of mechanized units. Uh, yeah, it was recommended that I look into these experimental stuff, blue screen protocol. Let's, let's start with the blue screen protocol. We've tried experimental in the past, but uh, 
It hasn't been bad. It just, uh, we still got 15 days for that because we're, because we did two things of experimental armor. I don't think there's anything else to do right now. Not now. That to get intel to get supplies. Avengers so yeah, let's actually go force. do that. Oh damn, I didn't even see that UFO. Was it there the whole time? We want to set up the aliens' work on the Avatar project. We should hit one of their facilities as soon as possible. I am sure you will find the results to be as intriguing as I do, Commander. Storm gun. Like I said, I'm assuming that shotgun. Uh, but now that we got these, let's go ahead this and fearsome creature, long do these. referred to as a berserker, is clearly a genetic relation to the other mutant species we have encountered in the field. For reasons yet unknown, this particular variant is unique in that it is altogether consumed by what can only be described as blind rage, a thirst for combat, unlike any other creature we've encountered. I don't know that that makes the most sense, because if that was true, then why isn't it, like, attacking everybody? I've started to wonder how the Advent Administration views our current band of renegades. It's a lot of, I guess, flavor dialogue. Stasis Vest. Grants additional two health to a soldier, and its built-in med kit will restore health to wounded soldiers. Okay, that sounds good. Commander, that UFO contact has us locked in. We have to take evasive maneuvers. 